the detection of saliva crystallization, ferning pattern in saliva. You can find this test on different titles. Ovulation microscope based on saliva, saliva ovulation test, ovulation fertility scope saliva based etc. The essence of the test is to take a sample of pure saliva daily so that it naturally dries within 15 to 30 minutes. After that in a special microscope, an increase of about 50 to 100 times it will be possible to see the formed crystals. The more estrogen in the biomaterial, the greater effect of fern. The more intense the leaf appears. The closer ovulation is. The process when saliva crystallizes in the form of fern leaves is called arborization. A positive result is as follows. The effect of fern, ferning, or crystal patterns appears before ovulation itself when there is the maximum level of the hormone estrogen in saliva. Three to four days before ovulation, there are many different images of dried saliva during a cycle. They can even be used in order to diagnose various reproductive system disorders. Crystallization of saliva is a great way to self-diagnose, allowing you to catch not obvious but important problems. Deviations from the norm require the obligatory consultation of a doctor. Some advisement for proper testing. Use clean saliva under the tongue. The best time is right after sleep before eating, drinking and brushing your teeth. Or one or two hours after eating or drinking should pass. The volume of biomaterial for analysis one drop without air bubbles. What is the right crystallization during the cycle? Normally, the first non-fertile days of the cycle when there is a small amount of estrogen, you will see only grains or seeds. Gradually on the 7th 9th day, with a cycle of 28 days, small branches begin to appear. On the 10th 12th DC, the first leaves are unclear. A positive test becomes when the fern is seen very clearly. Further, on the 2nd day after ovulation, the effect of fern decreases and by the 3rd DPO, the day past ovulation, almost completely stops. This picture remains until the end of the cycle. Note. The test is informative only in dynamics, without a preliminary study of your crystallization during at least one cycle, it is very difficult to understand right away. Two days before the release of an egg or four. I recommend this type of testing to natural researchers who have been fond of biology since childhood. When is it better to choose something else? In pharmacies the device is not often found. Mostly women order it via the internet. A test microscope is hard to get. This is the first point worth paying attention to. The second, it is not cheap. The price starts from $20. Here are the most popular brands. Fertile Focus, Personal Ovulation Microscope. Maybe Baby at Home Reusable Saliva Ovulation Tester. KNOWHEN saliva ovulation tests with a fertility monitor app and others. Here is another reason to think about whether you want to test, memorize, or compare and evaluate the results on a daily basis. If not, this option for determining fertility is not for you. Better choose tests for LH or folliculometry. What if there is no burning pattern in saliva at all? In this case, observe the crystallization of saliva in another cycle. It is likely that in this, the ovaries rest and there is no dominant follicle, like ovulation itself. This is normal, a woman has an ovulatory two or three cycles a year. After 35, the number of such rest periods increases significantly, link to the article in the description. Here are some changes in the image of crystallized saliva that your gynecologist needs to evaluate. During the cycle no distinct fern leaves were observed. The effect manifested itself several times in waves. The distinct fern effect lasted several days in a row or during the cycle. When to start planning. The fertile period occurs when estrogen begins to grow in the body about three to four days before ovulation and up to the first day past ovulation. In a microscope, you will see formed but rare, unclear outlined fern leaves. 
This is the average characteristic of the beginning of favorable days for conception. You have the highest chance of becoming pregnant one day before and on the day of ovulation when the fern is seen very clearly. Here is an example of zero to two days before ovulation. Advice. I recommend that during your first cycle of work with a chest microscope to arm yourself with additional methods for determining ovulation, LH tests or basal thermometry, for example. Thus, you will be sure of the correct encoding of tests for the saliva crystallization. Further, with the gaining of practice, you can use only one method that is most convenient for you. To everyone planning, I wish you a successful pregnancy and healthy babies.